Hello and a warm welcome from the south coast of England. This is the scene here in Brighton. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Brighton up against Crystal Palace. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Number 10, Alexis McAllister. And number 18, Danny Welbeck. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. And here's the Palace eleven. Well, no surprise really, they're matching up here, but there are many different ways they can approach this game. And I just think they'll be cautious today, certainly early on. Thank you for attending today's game at the Amex Stadium. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. Caicedo. Pascal Gross. Alexis McAllister. Plenty of options. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, no way through. Can they get in behind them? Rose. On to Estupinian. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Well back. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Well, Wilfried Zaha, often described as a bit of a one-off, a real talent, and no two ways about that, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him today? Well, Derek, we know he's got great pace, whether he's running with the ball or running in behind defenders, and that's what makes him such a threat on the counter-attack, and I'm sure that's going to be the tactics today from his team. And we saw the situation developing. Well, strong play here. Now, options are plenty. But really sticking to their task defensively. March. And back with Gross. March. It did look on for them, but not to be. Zaha. Well, a crucial intervention inside the box. Pascal Gross. March now. A reminder tickets for the next well game are available for second after the game. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Plenty of support here. Vital interception. The danger was very real. Excellent vision. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Well, that's so tight, isn't it? But on this occasion, he doesn't get the benefit of the doubt.
and a tidy tackle well, they need to get tighter here Hudson Edouard and they have possession again Welbeck McAllister still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it good tackle, it'll be a throw and possibilities inside the box that is how to put in a challenge he's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner well they've been frustrated for quite a while now but these fans have suddenly come to life Short corner favourite. Oh, moving it nicely. Gross. Joel Feldman. From a textbook interception. Odson Edouard. Breaking at pace. Zaha. And the keeper able to hold on to it. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. McAllister. Well, the referee blows the whistle, and that is all for the first 45 here at the Amex. Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, he struggled to have any real impact on the game. I think if they are to kick on in the second half, it's key that he sees a bit more of the ball, and hopefully with that, he can start to put that back line under a bit more pressure. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Really good attacking play. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? And the cross not quite accurate enough. Oh, off the line! Oh, a superb save! Can he find the right pass? Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. McAllister. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Well, they need to be more positive with their passing. Make more runs in behind the defence. Create overloads in the wide areas. And then we may see an improvement in those stats. Quite simply, they just need to get on the ball more than they have been. Zaha. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer, and you have to say it was on the cards. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Back underway, 1-0 it is.
March. And Feldman with it here. Joel Feldman. Pascal Gross. Webster in possession. Oh, good use of the ball. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes finally. Counter attacking, very much an option. A chance to whip it in. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Alexis McAllister. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. A really top-notch piece of defending. Well, this game will shortly be history and the home side appear to be on the wrong end of the scoreline. Stuart, give us your take. Well, I think their forward play has been poor today. They've not had enough movement from the front players and the midfield have been too safe with their passing. Unless that changes in these final few moments, they'll get nothing from this game. Just 10 minutes to go. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Well, Beck. That's excellent defending following the cross. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. Both managers are saying this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Who's going to get on the end of it? Dunk. There's a slide draw pass. Oh, a goal! An equaliser in the closing stages. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Ezi, Lokonga. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And there's the referee's whistle, still all square.